Hey, it's Natalie Lucier, and it's time to talk about WordPress themes. So let's look at my top recommended WordPress themes, and we'll look at two different categories of themes. Premium themes, which are themes that you pay for, and free themes that you can find online for free and install for free. So here I am, and this is DIYthemes.com, and they're the creators of Thesis. Now, Thesis is one of the premium themes that I'm going to be talking about, and it's what's called a theme framework. So what that means is it allows you to edit the look and feel of your theme if you're comfortable with programming and code. So if that's you, or if you want to hire a developer to customize the look and feel of your website, Thesis is one of the ways to do that. The second theme I have here, which is by StudioPress.com, is Genesis. So Genesis is another theme framework that allows you to uh, customize the look and feel of a theme and just make it look the way that you want to look. But again, you'll need to know a little bit of code to make this happen. So unless you're really comfortable with PHP or programming, this is probably not the way to go. But they do have... Uh, existing themes at studiopress.com that you can really just customize the header of and the rest of the theme will look great. So that's another option as well. And the theme that I totally love working with is Headway at headwaythemes.com. So this is actually a drag and drop creator for themes. So what you can do is you can have all kinds of different sizes and shapes of boxes and navigation items and you can really control where you want to put everything on your theme and on your website and it is really customizable you don't need to know how to program to really make this theme look awesome and it is again a theme framework so it allows you to set up the look and feel of your site however you want it to look so definitely take a look at headway themes if you have something that you want to do that's a little bit more custom and you're not so comfortable with programming so those were the premium themes. Now let's look at free themes. So if you Google free WordPress themes, you will find tons of free themes to make your website look great. And here I am on the WordPress directory where you can see a bunch of free themes that WordPress hosts and recommends. And in order to access these, you can actually go through your WordPress site. So here I am in my WordPress site. If I were to go under Appearance and Themes, and then Install Themes, I can actually search for existing free themes that are out there. So I could maybe go by colors if I wanted pink and red, and I can choose if I want two columns. Um, you can also see if there's other features that you're really looking for. And then you can literally just search based on those filters, or you could type in a term that you think might help you really explain what you're looking for as well. And then you can just take a look at these themes that come up here. So let's say I like this one right here. This is actually a preview of, of what this would look like if this were activated on my website right now. And if I like it, then I can literally just click install right here. It's going to download to my WordPress site. And then let me just preview again. And this is actually, OK. So as you can see, these are settings that I'd have to change. So there will be a couple of things to figure out once you install it. But this is what it would look like. And if I want this theme to be activated, I would just click Activate. And it's as easy as adding new themes that you found through WordPress to add free themes to your site. And you can also definitely take a look at Smashing Magazine's 100 Excellent Free WordPress Themes. They've curated an awesome list of free WordPress themes, and you can find that by Googling them or see the link below. So this video was all about themes, making your website look awesome, and customizing it. And I hope that you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you got something out of this, and I'll catch you next time.